I have brought you two here to face a great challenge. I've got nerves of steel and muscles of sand. And eyes of jelly. My Poseidon has been breached by a mighty foe whom you must vanquish. Bring it on, your highness. Bring it on. In this corner, defending the Poseidon, a small square guy. <laughs> and his challenger. A huge murderous robot shaped like a squirrel. Look, it's a giraffe. Uh, I think I need to get home to feed Gary. Fresh like a spring breeze. Great Barrier Reef. Now the robot's taking a beating out there! SpongeBob has an opening! But will he get the drop on the robot? I wanna play! I wanna play! And if we're not playing, we're fighting for our lives! I wanna play! I wanna play! That's much better. Spling! The old clothesline move! The robot's losing its head! What a shocking takedown by Patrick! Looks like Patrick has a big opportunity here. Oh, nice flying, uh, head thing move by Patrick. The robot's losing its head. Wow! I've never seen such an electrifying oh, match! That was fun. Your turn, SpongeBob! Oh? Uh we Spling! The old clothesline yeah. move! I feel like a new sponge! That's a bubble bash opportunity if ever I've seen one. Oh, what an uppercut! Fresh like a spring breeze. Ow! Nice move by SpongeBob. This match is just about over. Robot's vulnerability. Let's see if SpongeBob goes for it. Well, <laughs> that was quite a battle. Tell him what he's won, Johnny. It's a new power, the Bubble Bowl. But wait, there's more. A golden spatula, and that's not all. A gift certificate for $5.32 to Dean's Little Shop of Dried Fish Flakes and Flowers. Oh, thank you. It all means so much. I... I... I promised myself I wouldn't cry. Cry all you want, but not here. We just wax the floors.
Hey, Plankton. Yes, what is it? I was just wondering why all the robots seem to be coming from inside the chum bucket. Have they? I really haven't noticed. Uh, yeah. And then there's that big flashing neon sign that says, Robot Headquarters. SpongeBob, I'm your friend, right? No, not really. Exactly, and as your non-friend, I worry about you. Like right now, you're thinking too much. I'm worried you might really hurt yourself. Tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna think for you. This way you won't hurt yourself, and you can just keep working on getting me into the chum bucket. Thanks, Plankton. You're the best non-friend a friend could have. No more thinking for me.